Hey everyone, it's Corey McCarthy and thank you for tuning in. So this is not a video that I would have ever likely made had something uh, horrifying not recently happened to me. Now I feel that it is uh, the responsible thing to do. I mean, if this happened to me, it could happen to anyone. Last Friday, I had prepared a, a typical vegan ketogenic lunch for myself, a one pack of Beyond Meat with 250 grams of frozen chopped spinach, a sauteed in one and a half tablespoons of coconut oil, and topped with two and a half uh, tablespoons of freshly ground flax seeds. All were products that I had purchased the Sunday prior at a New York City Whole Foods Market. While cooking said items, I didn't notice anything out of the ordinary. Uh, fast forward a tiny bit, and I was sitting down for my lunch. After a few mouthfuls, I noticed something hard in my mouth. <laughs> Get your minds out of the gutters, uh, this is serious. At first I thought I had just bitten off a prong from the plastic fork that I was uh, using. Uh, it has happened before, you know, cheap shit. The goddamn thing was jagged and it poked the back of my mouth, and at this point it was resting on the back of my tongue, at a place where I could have easily swallowed it. I managed to stop myself and I pulled the object from the back of my mouth. At first I thought it was a stick. Uh, something that was picked up along with the spinach when it was being harvested. I mean, even Vegan Gaines told me that he commonly finds stones and shit in his produce. But as it turns out, it was a fucking bent nail. Yes, you heard that right. A nail. As in something that you'd hammer to build shit with. And here's the fucker right here. Uh, I saved it as evidence. I'm sure you can see it very well. I've kept it in a bag so it, uh, it remains with the, uh with the actual bits of spinach that was uh, pulled off with it. And this is the uh, bag of spinach in which it came from. Uh, Whole Foods 365 brand chopped spinach, a uh, product of the USA. My guess is, is that a loose nail got picked up along with the spinach uh, from the wooden crate it was being transported in. But some may blame it on the Russians. Who knows? Anyway, I not only called the New York Department of Health, but I also called the FDA and the USDA, and I've also uh, phoned that Whole Foods Market, which I purchased it from, and left a complaint, which apparently is being escalated to corporate, and furthermore, I've spoken with a lawyer. I mean, think about it. If this was in my bag, it could be in other bags, possibly from the same source. I mean, what if a child were to have swallowed this, or someone's pet? Uh, that would very likely have been fatal due to the size of the victim. In the case of an adult like myself, uh, Google informs me that if the nail is sharp or large enough, it could damage the gut, it could cause a lot of pain, and possibly lead to uh, dangerous internal bleeding and possibly even sepsis. But best case scenario, it would simply pass through the digestive system and out the asshole uh, without any serious event. And I've found examples of the latter on Google, like this dude who swallowed a drywall nail while doing housework. And a British lady who swallowed a nail that was in her Tesco TV dinner. But some folks may not be so lucky and would require surgery, uh, not only to remove the fucking nail, but to repair any internal damage that was caused by his presence. I guess this leads me to uh, my message for everyone watching this. Inspect your food carefully. Chew slowly, no matter how hungry you may be. Even do this at a restaurant because I did not notice anything out of the ordinary while I was preparing my own food. And one of my Facebook friends claims she almost drank glass shards at an expensive local New York City bar. So just please be careful. I also ask that all of you that are watching this, please share this video. This is the sort of public warning that everyone should be aware of, but no one likely thinks of. By not sharing this video, a warning like this, you are doing a serious disservice to those that you know. Also hit that like button or even the dislike button. Uh, either way, it will help promote this video and get it seen by others. And drop some comments below and get some dialogue going. Uh, has anyone out there um, ever had this happen to you or someone that you know? Did anyone actually swallow the foreign object? And if so, what happened? Do, do list all the details. Tell your story. Let's, let's share experiences so that others can possibly learn from it and be careful themselves. Finally, hit that subscribe button just below to receive updates from my channel. Otherwise, uh, I thank you all for watching and I'll see you all around in the uh, next video.